Hi, my name is Crystal. I'm from East Tennessee, and uh, so far I'm really enjoying the Birth Warrior Project. Uh, over the last two years, I have been immersing myself uh, in everything birth and uh, physiological birth on disturbed birth, um, what birth is on a physical, hormonal, and spiritual level. Um, in February, I was blessed to be able to witness a really good friend of mine give uh, birth on disturbed at home. Um, what would be considered a free birth and um, it was amazing and really opened my heart to the call of what it would be like to serve women through this journey. Um, I have not given uh, birth myself so uh, there are a lot of questions in my, my mind of what women really need um, even though I, I know all of the biological processes, hormonal processes and all of them um, all of that and, and and I haven't really nothing really new has been brought to my my eyes and and mind and in that aspect so far but what has happened is I've really been able to delve much deeper in myself and and, and what it would look like for me personally to serve women and also for me to help address the fear of of not being a allowed to because I'm not certified or being a fraud or or something like that and uh, and I didn't I, I didn't realize that those feelings were so deep in myself and apparently I'm not the only one um, as it seems to have come up in conversation quite a bit so while I'm not necessarily learning too much n new as far as physiological undisturbed birth because to be honest you all's podcast have already taught me so much and I've listened to pretty much every single one of them um, in addition to my own research um, and also listen to other podcasts in including some really mainstream podcasts um, that have some just absolutely horrific birth stories in them um, that really showed me what birth is not um, yeah so I would really recommend this course to to any woman who is hearing the call to be a radical birth keeper and to support women, uh, whether it is their friends or sisters or um, people who will find them and, and actually make um, a financial exchange uh, as part of uh, them serving them. This just has all the information just really succinctly in a in a way that makes sense in an order that makes sense So even if you're coming at it never having had a child never having experienced a birth with minimal knowledge But just something deep inside of you is is calling you to this work This is a great way to not only get all of that information or have that information reaffirmed um, but also to go really deep inside yourself and help address these these fears that society tells us there has to be an expert. It, there has to be somebody who is outside uh, of of ourselves to 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 look to. When really, as women, we are the experts, and also the mother is the expert. It's just kind of tiling into holding that space. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm really enjoying the course and I'm looking forward to seeing what's next, especially uh, using it as a way to mind meld some ideas about how I will attract the right people into my life, though I honestly don't think that will be a problem because it seems like I do this in all aspects of my life anyways. Um, but yeah, just using it as a, as a point of meditation to... to let the information come in clearly um, as I'm guided on this path. Um, yeah, I highly recommend the course and I really appreciate all you ladies do. Um, I feel like I know you both already so well uh, through hearing your voices on um, all of the podcast projects you, you all have done uh, collectively and, um, and separately. And yeah, all right. Have a great day.